especially you want to get up in the morning and work out with you. She coming with the smoothie when you wake up with the green juice and all that. Like, damn, baby, making sure them ass. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. When, when, that's what I'm saying, man. That's what's beautiful to me, right? You can talk about, like, a lot of red pill, manosphere guys out there, right? Black pill guys, looks maxing guys. They all want to talk about, you know, the most important attribute to a guy is a woman's looks. No, it's actually her duty. Like he said, making that smoothie for me, knowing that I'm working hard in the gym. You know what I'm saying? Like knowing after a boxing session, like, man, do you want me to massage you? Do you, you what you need, baby? What you need? I just love that. That's, you know what I'm saying? That's the closest I'm going to get to falling in love because I'm in love with me, right? But you do them type of things, I'm going to see you as beautiful as f bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what, those type of behaviors is what earns the title of beautiful right not what you look like on the outside but how you serve me you know what i'm saying do you deserve me and i'm gonna determine whether you deserve me by how you serve me triple t g game we back in his stand you already know what it is if you do not know who i am you should my name is diamond i run this channel called true to the game you already know why you came today today man as you guys can tell by the title of this video what we're gonna be reacting to a good woman is worth its weight in gold i can definitely agree with this she is just gonna be an added benefit to what you already have going on you're already somebody of value not high value low value but you're somebody of value you know your worth you know your, you love yourself you know your value and all of these things right and a, like having a good woman is only going to bring more joy into your life add on top of the joy that you have in your life we're gonna go ahead and get into it before we do go cop your merch man true to the game merch is out true to the game is on the front stop simping is on the back if you want my help directly make sure you hit the link in my description down below to book a call with me you ain't got no bitches you want one you got one bitch you want a ton make sure you hit the link in my description down below to book a call with me and i can give you some advice and if you are pimping out a simp like this video comment your thoughts down below hit the subscribe button select all notifications so you do not miss an upload where i'm getting you closer to being a pimp less of a simp let's get into it let's do it woman go to break it down for him. man a good woman worth more than gold you know what i'm saying a good woman not only what she'll do for you she'll lie still kill go to jail for you but a good woman will give you that right energy that you need she'll give you that inspiration when you down she'll tell you nah you that man you that nigga you, you you a king you know and that shit is valuable man a woman's energy what a woman bring to me energy wise is worth more than any money she could bring me Cause so first and foremost to attract a good woman, you have to be a good man. In my case, I've got to be a good woman, right? For me to attract a good woman and a woman of value, I've got to see the value in myself first, right? I've got to love myself first. And the women that I attract are going to love me as well. They're going to value me as well. They're going to see my worth and my value because I see it in myself, right? I've got to be the positive driving force within my own life, leading my own way. And the woman is just there to add on top of it. So I don't want you guys to think that you need a woman. The women that I deal with, right? I, I fuck with them. I fuck with them the long way. But you should never need anyone. You came in this world alone, you'll die alone as well. Okay? And so you should never rely on anyone for, for your happiness. You should never rely on anyone for just validation or or for support emotionally or any of that you got to sort that shit out for yourself anything that a woman brings into your life is only going to be the toppings on your ice cream right it's only going to be the additions to your steak if you have a steak right you being the man that you are being the person of value knowing loving yourself respecting yourself and accepting yourself 100 percent you are already the steak you don't need a bitch to bring anything to your plate right but if she wants to you can spice that steak up with what maybe some a1 sauce or your favorite barbecue sauce right some people like blue cheese on their steak right so these things are additions the steak is already a good fucking steak all right but that woman can add value to that steak. They can make that steak just a little bit sweeter, even though the steak is already good as hell as it is, right? Just like ice cream. Ice cream is good by itself. Whatever your favorite ice cream is, whether it be vanilla, Rocky Road, 
pistachio. It's already good as is. But the woman can add her toppings to it. Let me make your ice cream just a little bit sweeter. What can I do for you, baby? Can I add some sprinkles? Can I add some spice? Can I add something nice? Can I add some pecans, some almonds? Can I add some chocolate drizzle? Can I add some syrup? Can I add some whipped cream that you can lick off of me? That's what a woman can do for you, right? A woman does not need to be the steak. When you make the woman the steak, what happens when the steak doesn't want to be ate anymore? What if the steak doesn't want to be served anymore? You've got to serve your own steak. You've got to be your own steak. You cannot rely on a woman to be your steak, right? If you rely on that woman to be that steak, that steak is not promised to be there. That steak is promised to be there if you are the one that put the steak on the motherfucking plate. Stop looking for a woman or anything else to be the steak on your plate. You must be that steak on your plate. That way no one can take that shit away from you, okay? That is something that is cultivated from within that you cannot get from anything or anyone. All right. I just want to make that very, very clear that we're not making the woman the steak. We are the steak by, by ourselves. We are able to serve ourselves steak. That woman is just coming with the additions. So I want to make that very, very clear. As beautiful and great as women, women can be and as much value as they can bring to your experience, You've already got to be having a dope experience as is. You've already got to be living a great life without them. Okay? So I just want to make that very, very clear. I don't want you guys to think, oh man, I need a woman to have a great life. You must have a great life before that woman enters. And she only wants to add, like she only wants to be an addition to that good life. Okay? So. You in a household with a woman who got an attitude problem, who bring you issues, who texting you when you out the house. And if you're in that situation, get out. Get out. Get out. It's already too far gone. If you're allowing, if you're living with a bitch who's disrespectful, if you're dealing with a bitch who's disrespectful, bruh, you don't love yourself. A man who truly loves and values himself and accepts himself, respects himself, is not going to tolerate a bitch being disrespectful in his presence. Because a bitch who is in his presence should know that being in his presence is a present. So she can get her fucking disrespectful ass on somewhere. And that's not being rude or mean. That's loving yourself, knowing your worth and valuing yourself, respecting yourself enough to say, I love me more than I will ever allow a bitch to come in and tell me why I shouldn't love me. Because why the fuck am I dealing with these shenanigans? I'm not dealing with this shit, bro. Point blank, period. So if you're dealing with a disrespectful woman, you already know that something within you doesn't respect yourself, doesn't love yourself, doesn't value yourself. Because if you did, you would get rid of her. Point blank, period. Draining your energy. And they say time is everything. Time is money. No, energy is everything. Oh, because on, if you got all the time in the world, but your energy ain't right, you ain't going to do nothing with your time. Man. So when you got a woman who giving you the right energy, when you ain't got to worry about nothing, when she ain't tripping, then you can focus on your goals. You can focus on your dream un unobstructed. Look, a real nigga is not going to be obstructed by a woman anyway, right? A, a real nigga is not even going to have a disrespectful woman with bad energy in his vicinity, in his presence, right? He's only going to have women around him that knows beyond a shadow of a doubt that his presence is a present because he knows beyond a shadow of a doubt that his presence is a present. So if you want to waste it, if you want to like act like it's not a present, he's just going to get rid of you. Point blank. It's just that easy. It's that simple, right? A real man cannot be knocked off course by a woman. Point blank, period. You know what I'm saying? So, it, I mean, it's powerful to have the right woman around. The right sure. woman around. Yeah, the right, right woman. And, and then not only just that mental fortitude of she building with you and building around you, especially you want to get up in the morning and work out with you. She coming with the smoothie when you wake up with the green juice and all that. Like, damn, baby, making sure them I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. When, when, that's what I'm saying, man. That's what's beautiful to me, right? You can talk about, like, a lot of red pill, manosphere guys out there, right? Black pill guys, looks maxing guys. They all want to talk about you know the most important attribute to a guy is a woman's looks no it's actually her duty like he said making that smoothie for me knowing that i'm working hard in the gym you know what i'm saying like knowing after a boxing session like man do you want me to massage you do you, you what you need baby what you need i just love that that's you know what i'm saying that's the closest i'm gonna get to falling in love because i'm in love with me right but you do them type of things, I'ma see you as beautiful as fuck, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what those type of behaviors 
is what earns the title of beautiful, right? Not what you look like on the outside, but how you serve me. You know what I'm saying? Do you deserve me? And I'm going to determine whether you deserve me by how you serve me. That's a bar right there. I'm going to determine if you deserve me by how you serve me. God damn it. Let me write that shit down. Hold on, man. <laughs> Poking out right? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what we need more in this world, man. We're going to talk about the gator food, the bitch we throw in the moats. We know that. Y'all ain't nothing. Y'all know who y'all are. We're going to salute the real man. Salute to the real women out here really putting in work for niggas who they know are, are worthy of it. Niggas who they know are valuable, of value, right? Shout out to the ladies. Shout out to my ladies, man. You know what I'm saying? Putting their duty over their booty. I fuck with y'all the long way. You know what I'm saying? Look, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. If you need some help, if you want my help directly, make sure you hit the link in my description down below to book a call with me. You ain't got no bitches you want one. You got one bitch you want a ton. Hit that link in my description down below to book a call with me. That way I can give you some advice on your situation. Go cop the merch. True to the Game merch is out. True to the Game is on the front. Stop simping is on the back. And if you are pimping out a simp, like this video. Comment your thoughts down below. Hit the subscribe button. Select all notifications so you do not miss an upload where I'm getting you closer to being a pimp. Less of a simp. I will see you in the next one. And last but not least, I'm out this thing. Stay true to the game.